Coming off their first win in the Lane Kiffin era, Ole Miss returns home and is ready to take on the number two team in the country. Shades of 2017, it was another thriller in Lexington last week. After UK missed their extra point in overtime, the Rebs offense went to work. Matt Corral hit Elijah Moore on a sprint out, allowing Luke Logan to split the uprights for the game winner. Corral was fantastic again in week two, completing 83% of his passes for 320 yards and four scores. One to Moore, one to tight end Kenny Yaboa, and two to Jonathan Mingo. The sophomore from Brandon hauled in eight passes for 128 yards in the game. He became the first receiver not named Elijah Moore to go over the century mark in receiving since November of 2018 when both A.J. Brown and Demarcus Lodge eclipsed the mark against Vandy. The Rebel offense has been the storyline through two weeks. Simply put, they've been on fire. Ole Miss ranks third nationally in passing yards per game. Matt Corral ranks first or second in the SEC in nine offensive categories. And his favorite target, Elijah Moore, leads the country in receiving yards per game. This week, they'll try to stay red hot against the Crimson Tide, who are 2-0 after coming off of a win against Texas A&M. Alabama has had our number the last few seasons, but we'll see if Lane Kiffin has some tricks up his sleeves as he takes on his old boss this weekend in Oxford.